Uh, question 208. What skill or craft would you like to master? Oh. I, 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 I've been teaching myself to be ambidextrous. And I want to learn how to draw Ooh. with my left hand. Cool. I want to be, like, my, my sister could stick her thumb in the ground and grow a tree. That's how much of a green thumb she is. Yeah. And I want to be able to do that because I've I've attempted to grow things and it's hit or miss for me. Even if I follow the instructions, even if I, you know, do what you're supposed to do, it just it's not like what she can do. I'm am telling you, she's you know my my sister can grow anything and everything, and she lives eight thousand elevation in Arizona, and she's able to make things that don't grow there grow there, mm. and it's 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 maddening. <laughs> But it helps someone to be self-sustainable, at least when it comes to food, too. <clears throat> Manda. Um, I've always wanted to be able to fucking fix cars. Like, my car is fucked right now. It's been in the shop for a couple weeks, I'm pretty sure, it, but it's just done. Um, I, and I've had a couple boyfriends that were mechanics or worked on cars, and I've always been fascinated with that. Uh, so that probably. I thought she was going to say she wanted to be a scientist. And let's see, aren't you? I thought she was going to say fix climate change. Well, well I mean, see, she's already got that trade, though. That's the thing. <laughs> no, I'm trying. Yeah, but this I'm is trying. a question would you like to be better at? So. <laughs> this. And I got to say, I think <laughs> if I had to pick something, it would probably go down soldering. I'm nothing. Uh, see, soldering. I can. That's that's my trade right there. Actually, see, I can I'm... solder. I'm just shit at it because I don't do enough. But I don't have enough <laughs> really? that I want to do. It pulls down to the equipment too. It, it you yeah, have right. a good iron. My um, have... my grandmother learned to solder during the um, Second World War, and she was exceptionally good at it. So excuse me, excuse showed, weren't uh, terminals a lot bigger then? In general, yeah. <laughs> that's not the point. When I started showing an interest in electronics, she insisted that I learn to do it properly. Why not? So I'm actually pretty good at soldering. <laughs> well, I'll send you everything I need soldered. No, screw that. <laughs> uh... I had to replace the power button on a Nexus 5 phone, which is a surface mount switch with four pins right next to each other. And I could not get that. I could not get all four at the same really? time. No. A little bit of solder I, um, <laughs> Yeah, a little bit of solder week. I, um, because I, my air gun wasn't working properly and I, I had to do a hard drive repair for somebody where I had to, um, because they had the board die on a Western digital hard drive and I had to take the, um, encoder chip off the original board solder it to the other board and swap the board over to the other hard drive and I desoldered that fucking chip by hand with the normal soldering iron and soldered it on the next one and put in a replacement track for a damage track that was on the board and I did that all with a normal soldering iron by hand and it worked perfectly. That's bloody hard to do. <laughs> yeah, it, it is. I can actually say that uh, my hands have a lot of heat tolerance but when I started <laughs> <laughs> I end, Yeah, I, each time oh, I kind of solder I keep Yes. I keep ending up with calluses all over them. Um, Doorknob says he's NASA certified in soldering, which means he's yet another NASA Ooh. shill. Ooh. Ooh, no, no. Ooh. Wait, 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 no, being NASA certified, hey, that, that means you can't make a mistake. <laughs> you can't go back and yeah. wick away and read. No, there, there's no putting no, a little fuck there and right the it. Time. You had to do it right the first time. Excellent. Yeah. <laughs> Bill. Uh, yeah, for me, it would be welding. I can do the basics, but but I'd really like to be able to do proper, be very skilled at both TIG and MIG welding. Why because TIG and MIG rather stuff, than ARC? ARC is far better. Well, yeah, yeah, but ARC, ARC is TIG and MIG, isn't it? Like well, no, well, they are, but they, they require... Okay. But, but anyway, the, the point being that obviously there are certain things that cannot be done by machine. Like the world will always need humans to weld things. Like it, it, it will always be a required thing. Just purely because of the fact that like certain things, you can't put a machine into a certain space where a human can actually get into that space. Do you know what I mean? There's, That's becoming like, less of a problem as time goes on. It's becoming less yeah. of a problem, but it will always be 
there, there will always be a requirement for manual welders yes. somewhere. It will always be a requirement. It, they'll never. No, but there's no the reason why that manual welder can't be a humanoid machine. No. No, that 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 is true. That is true. If you, if it was a humanoid a humanoid machine, that is true. Um, but it would need to be it would need to be an almost android level machine. Do you know what I mean? Like um, we can build machines fairly close to that now. Did you, have you watched yeah, the video yeah. of, of uh, Boston Robotics? The, the one that just shows the, the progress over the last ten years. Of Boston Robotics. Yeah, yeah. That's an excellent video. Um, yeah, and yes. excellent robots. Um, what do we got here? Uh, Shadow Kitty says they'd like to be multilingual. I, I part you of me. You did not, me, Dave. <laughs> did I not? I you did not. What would you what, like what to rest? I, I would like to be better at art because when it comes to creating new stuff, uh, I'm good at putting shit together, but actually creating my own original artworks, uh, I I suck at. Uh, especially when it comes to doing 3D modeling and stuff like that, and I really wish I was decent at it because there's so many times I could have use for it. I don't have an artistic bone in my body, <laughs> literally, <laughs> which is a shame. Mine is more of words than it is of, of art, so. <laughs> <laughs> so I, I'd like to be able to do what Sal can do because that would that would be fucking awesome. Sal I'm very jealous of Sal's Sal skills. Tip, yo. Sal is oh, yeah. amazing. I, 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 I would be happy with better specialization. I'm quite happy to make things talk to each other and work. But every job you go to now, they seem to want to make you want you to make it look pretty as well. Yeah. Yeah. I like pretty though. Pretty is nice. Yes, pretty is nice. But expecting someone that is highly yeah. skilled in 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 programming to be able to make things look nice it's not well i agree with you there it, it, it's not I, I really do yeah oh. it's why most programming is done in teams actually so you, you share the skills across a range of people yes so. uh, no that's how it's meant to work <laughs> but that doesn't work like when you're doing your own personal projects because no. you've got to be able to do the whole lot and the bit that i find it like most in is the artwork for things like there's been plenty of times i've put code together to make games and um i get to the point where i need to design characters for this game or i need to design 3d models and i give up yes <laughs> i'm like no i can't do it i just cannot do it, it I, I spent four hours designing a spoon in um in adobe uh 3d effect 3d you know whatever it is the 3d modeler at for Adobe. Yes. Four hours designing a spoon. And I'm like, that's one model for this entire thing I'm creating. And no, no, I can't do this. It was going to drive me nuts. <laughs> yes, completely agree. Jessa, did you answer? I always. I did. Gardening was what I wanted. You're right. To go my bad, you were first. Horticulture. Bill, go on. I was just going to say, I always think that these sort of skills, it's good to have a skill that you can, that you can perform which doesn't require it basically that you can get paid in cash for if we have to live in a capitalist society you get paid in cash for you don't have to put any of it on the books you don't have to have any connection to anything do you know what i mean a, a skill that you can do with your hands and you can get paid in cash not have to pay anything to the government fuck all of that yes you know what I mean? like, the problem is yeah. that you that <sighs> The complexity of the things we make now, it is not possible to be specialised and everything. complete a project. Very few people can, mm. can, can economically do a project from beginning to end and do everything mm. in it. Um, and you, you can have people that, that don't, you can have better specialisation, but then you have to have the expectations set out right so you can have someone that delivers something that's ugly, for example, on the understanding that that's what they're getting, something that's ugly, and then there will be someone else's labour that makes that pretty. Yeah. Um, I don't disagree with you. I just think that that, that we need this. It's, it's this problem we've got over here. No, I'm not going to go into it. It's, it's government. No, forget that. <laughs> 
Yeah, let's <laughs> move on. <laughs> what do you say, Dave? Yeah. Continue. Continue. Next question. Next question. <laughs> Why are all these skill ones in here? Uh, it's entirely your what? fault. It's yeah, your I know orders. it is. <laughs> I, I should have reordered them. I blame Manda. Yeah. <laughs> I can't blame Mathpick. I didn't see him yesterday. I saw Amanda. He's in the chat, though. No, I did see him. <laughs> I'm taking the piss. Right. Well, yeah. <laughs> if it's his fault, it's my fault, too. So. Right. <laughs> if you enjoyed that, please hit the thumbs up button. If you didn't, hit the thumbs down. If you think you've got a better answer or just want to tell us how wrong we are, leave a comment down below. Subscribe down here for new questions every day and make sure you hit the bell so you don't miss out on our live shows. If you click over here, you'll see our latest upload. Over here for what YouTube thinks you'll love the most. And finally, for a complete playlist of all our currently recruited least questions, click here.